Hi, good evening, and it's time to bring you some sports news right here on News 360. My name is Thierry Nyan. Now, we start off, uh, of course, with the budget that was read earlier today in the House of Parliament. Now, Ghana uh, government has allocated a total of, of 46.9 million Ghana cities to the Ministry of Youth and Sports for the year ending December 31, uh, 2017. Now, reading the abridged version of the 2017 budget statement before the House of Parliament, the Finance Minister. Minister Ken Oforiata said, in the area of sports development, feasibility studies will be completed to facilitate the expansion of the infrastructure stock and transform the National Sports College into a center of excellence through public-private uh, partnership arrangements. Additional efforts will be made to support other disciplines starting from our schools. But in the unabridged version of the 2017 uh, budget, these are the details. So the ministry will facilitate the participation of African qualification tournaments for the Black Queens, the Black Princesses, and the Black Maidens, and also the 2018 World Cup uh, qualifiers for the Black Stars, and also the completion of the University of uh, Ghana Sports Complex. Uh, the, so the total uh, sports budgets for 2017 uh, is 46.9 million Ghana cities. Now, that is a clear difference on the 22 million Ghana cities that, uh, you know, was allocated to the Youth and Sports Ministry last year under the last, uh, you know, government. Uh, so, about 24 million Ghana cities difference from last year and this year to the Youth and Sports Ministry. But uh, uh, we move away from there now. We go straight to the Ghana Premier League, uh, where Great Olympics early woes were compounded on Thursday after a three one defeat to Bicham United at the Accra Sports Stadium in a delayed Ghana Premier League fixture. Ivorian striker Matt Turi recaptured his former self and bagged in a brace as the FA Cup winners registered their first win of the season. The Wonder Club are left bottom of the league table after their third defeat in four games in the Ghana Premier League, while Bicham United have climbed to ninth on the standings, still with a game in hand. 